Hello there everybody, the name's Prototype, and I'm going to be playing this time. <laughs> why did that not why is why is this happening again? Because uh oh we saved it and it's uh the um uh the gets all checked by but yes, guys, anyway, if, if you haven't watched the first one, you've just missed me jump out of my skin. Hello there, Mr. Man. Who is that guy? Hello there, Mr. Man. Who is that man? I don't know. Well, I, I do know. I'm not going to look for him. No, I, I would prefer it if I actually found out on my own. Little face. Oh, no! <laughs> no, 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 Is that supposed to happen? Yes. Yes, it is. Jesus, that guy was ugly. Oh yes. So people got like that from dreaming. And who are you then? Nobody. Nobody you need to worry about, Mr. Creepy Man. I, I see. Merciful God, you have sent me an apostle. Guard your life, son. You right. have a calling. You are one creepy man. Okay, so now we're regaining consciousness. As we're being thrown from a window. First floor, first floor window. Claim of the gospel. Whoa, these guys have just been ripped apart. Yeah, they have been. Okay, my turn to read. Uh, in the matter of the seizure of Mount Massive Psychiatric Center, Murkoff Psychiatric Systems, and all that, offendative having been made before the Board of Directors by Murkoff Headline Security, Hardline Security, MHS, who has reason to believe catastrophic security failure of psychiatric center with immediate danger of environment contamination. We are satisfied that the affectant, offendivant? Affidant. Affidant. And testimony established sufficient evidence to require urgent action on the part of MHS. Hang on, so that's just affidant. Affidant. Basically, bit. that's that word that we, uh, I'm having trouble saying. And the grounds of the insurance of this one, you are hereby required to grant MHS full access to all faculties and surrender complete authority. Facilities. Facilities. Fine. Facilities and surrender complete authority. Authority to its agents by acceptance of this document, you and the surviving relatives surrender all claims of lit 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 litigation. litigation against the Murkoff Corp or its sub 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 subsidiaries. subsidiaries. Sorry, guys, I can't talk today. For the action of MHS or the circumstances which require their actions, regardless of responsibility. Wow, they, they, they had an extra page just for the word responsibility. Yes, they did. It's as if someone couldn't gather the sort of... Oh, this mouse. The cognitive function to just put the the page back up one. Dude, I'm going to have to change this mouse. Have you? There we no, go. There we are. There, there we, we go, finally. So, guys, I'll probably skipped over that uh, so you don't have to sit through it. It was prototype Hello. being peaky, peaky. a bit silly... Hello, Mr. And changing Man. his mouse. I'm going to sneak ever so quietly behind you. Please do not wake up. Please do not. What, what do you think of him, Yessi? What earth is wrong with him? You okay? I'm going to leave you. So please. Bear. Ooh. What is up with these guys? Are they normal? Uh, well, as normal as can be. Look. Thanks. I'm inside. Uh, I'm inside. Uh, I'm inside. Bodies everywhere. Blood. Burn marks. Heads lined up like bottles behind a bar. Dead Murkov scientists hung from the ceiling. The badges say Murkov Advanced Research Systems. Murkov's longtime MO has been to profit off the exploitation <coughs> of supposed charity. F the third world and bankrolled another billion. How did Murkoff think they would make money off a building full of crazy people? There's some kind of tactical coup, cop, uh, tactical cop pinned like a pig on a spit, tell me to get the F out and then dies. Would have been a good thing to hear when I could still leave the way I came. And broken men and their television. 
A crowd of broken men watching a dead channel. They look like patients. They survived whatever happened here, but nobody's home. Okay. So that's these guys. Yeah, these are these guys watching that TV. Now, yes, you can't hear it. But there's a chorus going on in my ears. I need this one, please. Thank you. So using using the camera normally doesn't drain the battery. No. What's going on there? What? Why why is it not draining the battery? Because it's only for the um. Uh, um, night vision. That makes this game makes no sense. It's not meant to make sense. It's just meant to scare you. I'm going to leave you to that. Oh, you've got to get past him. Yeah, I've got to get past him. Hopefully, I can sneak by him again. What happens if he wakes up? I don't know. Do you have to run. Uh, I don't know. Run away! He just attacked me. See him. What? What he did? People saw him attack me. Ah, that's a... I don't know. And then you I'm turn around and there's another person waiting for you. No, hopefully not. Oh, journal. Journal. Project Wall, other painted status. Uh, morphogenic engine activity plateaued. Plateaued? Yeah. Plateaued at roughly 2,000 ppm, unsafe to progress beyond stage 3 hormone schedule. Diagnostics. Spiriod... Spirimetry... Revealed light to medium bronchial accumulation. MRI scans consistent with patients' re recorded dreams. Reported. Reported dreams. I'm sorry, I'm reading this quickly, guys. Walker was interviewed in restraints following his self-inflicted mutilations. Restraint have been altered to accommodate his enormous size. That's the person who's following us. Oh, right. What's his name? Uh, Walker. Uh, extensive dermal... Uh, eruptions as consistent with failed morphogenic engine cellular activity. He claims the skin ripped from his forehead allows for a truer way of seeing. Seems to have some boyhood experience with uh, Tuatara tua lizards and their peripheral eyes. He has expressed anxiety about his flesh, specifically around his lips and nose, attending all Orderlies should be advised to watch for further self-mutilation. The mental traumas he sustained while serving in Afghanistan seem to be retarding progression of the ME process. His pre predominant. predominant fixation amplified by therapy is a magic, magic, manic, manic exaggeration of military security protocol. A continuation of both chemical and physical restraints is highly recommended. And obviously he's broken free and killed people. Yes, this is true. So, I now have a key card. Oh, just oh, sorry, man, I just stepped over you. Sorry. Let me go down. I forget. Oh no. Come in. Let's have a look. No. Okay. So we need to get to security control. Hello, Mr. Camera. That big dude's coming after you. Oh no! I want no! I want it. Do you have to hide from him? Uh, witness. I'm only beat all to hell, picking broken glass out of my scalp. Couple cracked ribs, nearly killed by a deformed giant. Looks like somebody tried to f start his head with a cheese grater. He throws me through a wall, knocks me unconscious. I woke up in some do dodgy old man with a face like an alcoholic kidney fiddler, in a homemade priest outfit, calls me his apostle. Not a job I asked for. There are words scored in blood everywhere. I'm getting an ugly feeling in my gut that the priest is writing them for my benefit.
The yeah, arm. Is. It's a head. And an arm. And an arm. That doesn't go down the toilet. No, it doesn't. If I remember correctly. Oh, jeez. <laughs> uh, battery. Oh, door closed. Is that my way, light? I have a bad feeling that that person who was trying to get into that other room is going to come chasing after me. Me? Me, don't you mean? After you? Yeah, because it's my turn. Oh, dear. This is where I need to go. I'm just going to check up here. Hello, Mr. Man. Uh, I'm not going to read this. I'm going to just put it up. So you can pause it and read it here if you so wish. Any batteries on the floor? Excuse me, sir. Do you have a battery? No. Okay. I was I was Yeti uh, slamming my phone against the desk. <laughs> if any of you wanted to know, but you probably no. didn't. No, they're all fine. Close the door. Uh, yes, please. Tap, tap, tap. How does he know what to put? Okay. Oh, hello, Mr. Man. Don't do that. Please don't do that. No. Oh. I need to hide. Why do you need to hide? You'll find out. You have to hide. See, it says hide in the locker. Not bite. He's a coming through. Uh, he's a huge. He's, he's a beastie, isn't he? He's a big bloke. They check the cupboards for you. He's a sousaphone man. Yeah. Go on, walk away. Please. Walk away, please. There we go. There we go. And... Whispering something. Can't make it out. Cool. I can still hear him. Is he gone? Yes, he's gone. Whew. What? How does he know where you are? Uh, because you make sound. What? No! I pushed the wrong button. Why did you press R? I pushed R. I wasted the battery. No, you didn't. You still got three out of ten. No, I got four. We had four to begin with. Again, I'm going to do this so you can pause it and then see it. And then the second page. And done. Any other things here? Ooh! Battery. To replace the one which you used yes. recklessly. Yes. Who's there? Was it? No one. Someone, what is going on? Someone in the darkness. And anyway, guys, I'm all out of time for this one. So um, I'll leave this uh, bit for Yeti to do with the ominous button. I, I, we will see you in the next one, guys. Thank you all so much for watching, and take care. Take care, guys.